Apparently warning, but oh well, minus Fox Knight. So they can have Fox. I really need to get light for my face better. But um, this is a game that I really don't know much about. Other than one, it's a chapter. It has a cartoony looking character, and that DeviantArt is drawing a lot of crap about it. So it must be good. Let's get into this. Um, dear Henry, seems a like a lifetime since we worked on our cartoons together. Thirty years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Um, your best pal, jo Joey Drew. Joey Drew, everyone. Joey Drew. You all know Joey, right? Brooklyn Rage! Oh, look at that little cute little guy in the corner. Look at that guy. Chapter 1, moving pictures. Alright, Joey. I'm here. Okay. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. I think the guy who made this... Drew, or not Drew, um, made the, um, uh, what is it called? Made one of the FNAF game, like, uh, Treasure Island games, I think? Dreams come true. Really now? Um, dreams come true. This is Ink. So, the question is, am I a cartoon? Am I a tune in this? Hold on. Okay, there we go. A little bit better. It's kind of low in my seat. Okay, so... I guess maybe I have to go here? Do I have to sit down? Okay. I have no shadow! Okay, I have no idea what's going on. Um, I, lo I love the, like, the old-fashioned cartoon look. And this game actually looks pretty awesome. It's... Uh, the head bobbing is kind of weird, but it's fine. The dancing demon, of course, because all kids it's in the night. Desk. I've wasted so much time in this chair. Wait, hold on. Da -da 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 -da. Yes, because in the 1950s, when cartoons like these were made, everyone loved demons. Uh, Mr. Cartoonist, do you know that everything is a cartoon, and that that head is also floating? I don't know, maybe I have to go back the way I first went. No? I'm, I'm actually kind of intense, right? I'm intense, though. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. There's a light coming from this dude. Ink machine. Uh, Bendy Demon Man, are you in there? Uh, hold on. Before I do anything else, let me close my door because I feel like I'm going to scream. But let me not go to the ink machine yet. Uh, I don't know what the game's actually name it. Stop it, paper bag on the floor. You know what? Let's just go to the ink machine. I'm assuming that's where I'm supposed to go. So this is the ink machine. Huh? Stop with the noise. I wonder how you turn it on. I don't know, but does it make cartoons come to life? What is the point of this ink machine? Is the ink possessed? Are we having a FNAF situation right now? Where you just need to shove a dead body and something that comes to life? Actually, no, I think they actually have kind of like a theory, though. That it's probably not even ghost in FNAF. But um I am slouching and that's not good. That's no good. Why do I feel like at some point these are either gonna disappear or I hate that. Hello it's me. Ha ha ha. That didn't scare me, you joiks. You can't scare me, I'm unspoopable. What you? What are you? Oh my God, Joey, what were you doing? Yeah, what were you doing? Wait, so did he make living tunes? Is this in a world of Who Framed Roger Rabbit? Who's laughing now? Oh yuck! I'm sure ain't not laughing no more, am I, Mickey? Yuck! This is like freaking um Epic Mickey, but like. Wait, what does that say? 
the illusion of living. Oh, that sounds like fun. Main power. All right, how do I get this to work? Stop it! I freaking yeah, you, you out there? Stop it! Stop! Okay, good. Okay. Uh, okay. So, what do I need to find these items and put them here? Is this a slender manish type of scenario? I, I was more like saying like, okay, the, the little boom. It's like the dead dude from Bioshock, except like jump scary. How do I raise the pressure? Why did something go quiet? Oh, because that one area has is quiet. Ah! Oh, who put this here? I need to find items and then put them on the pedestal. I'm that's what I'm taking from that. Oh, Bendy, my Bendy. At oh. this point, I don't get what Joey's plan is for this company. The animation sure aren't being finished on time anymore, and I certainly don't see why we need this. Turn my head right. It's noisy, it's messy, and who needs that much ink anyway? Also, get this. Joey had each one of us donate something from our workstation. We put them on these little pedestals in the break room. To help appease the gods, Joey says. Keep things going. I think he's lost his mind. But hey, he writes the checks. But I tell you what, if one more of these pipes burst, I'm out of here. Yeah, pipes boys, got it. And you find these items to appease the tunes? I guess. Why well, I feel like something's gonna come out of the camera. I feel like at some point in time something's gonna pull itself through that freaking um, screen. And I'm not gonna like it one bit. So I'm supposed to summon the tunes? It makes tunes? It's an evil Roger Rabbit. What's going on? Uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Dreams come true. Oh, Walt Disney. Hope you. Oh, Dolly. Well, I don't want. I really don't want to pee this sucker off. But come on, Mr. Ghostly Goo or or Inky Poo. I'm not sure if this is a fully fledged game. I just saw it, like, again, I saw fan art of it. And I'm like, alright, I guess this game is getting popular, so might as well try it out. I thought it was going to be like a FNAF game. Well, actually, I haven't played FNAF. Which is the one that you free roam? I think you free roam? I don't know. Oh, gear. Oh, wait. Wrench, book, and a pen. I'll tell you what, it has atmosphere, I'll give it that. Um, and you know, it's kind of, it, it, it is kind of in a similar vein of FNAF in a sense of, well, it's like a similar vein in the, the, in the name of FNAF slash, um, what is that Furby wannabe? I can't freaking remember his name right now. The Furby thing. Um, like, in the sense that, yeah, these are based off of, kind of based off, like, properties you know, well, they are based off of properties you know about. Um, FNAF being Chuck E. Cheese animatronics and, well, animatronics in general. Um, Furby mini animatronic, a uh, little Furby death doll. Um, yeah, I had a Furby, I like them. But, like, again, like, this is the Disney version. It's kind of like the, uh, it's kind of like, um, corrupting the innocent. Not really innocent, because, yeah, lord, the Chuck E. Cheese dolls. Chuck E. Cheese things. Um, well, it's like corrupt, like, you know, corrupting the thing that you kind of knew for a little bit. And, you know, just turning it on its head and making it into a horror game, which is awesome. Um, I need a pen. Oh. I'm an idiot. Stop it! I hate you. Okay, so... The guy was talking about drawing over here. That's why I'm kind of rounding my way back around here since, you know, cartoonists, pens... So even though it seems like everybody was drawing the exact same thing. I don't know what's with this sound. Maybe, maybe it's my gain. Maybe my gain's a little too high. I don't know. But whatever it is, it makes me it makes everything sound kind of weird. 
I think it's just because I have uh, because like you maybe you guys can't well you can hear my voice of course but maybe you you can't well I'm pretty sure you can't hear it because I'm talking but I'm also hearing my voice so it's not like I'm getting a extremely crystal clear sound because you know I hear this idiot this annoying guy talking every time I go maybe I left something back there okay so I need a book which there was a book back there, so maybe I need to grab, grab that. It was by that one dude's body. I need a book and a pen. Unless the book is gonna be the last thing. It's like, oh no, jump scare. I don't know, maybe this sucker's gonna try to grab me now. Please don't. Yeah, I got the book. Illusion of free will, I guess. Is that the ink pen? Don't come to life, please. Yeah, hey, here it is. Yay! Please don't kill me. Okay, it's all. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. I can't run, which is scaly. Okay, so I need to. Okay, I need to head back to that one area and press the button. That's appeasing the god crap. Um, or god. Ah! Hmm. That is a good freaking jump scare. I this is some spoopy freaking house of horrors bull crap you're pulling right now, buddy. Stop it! I hate you. I'm gonna go ahead and kill myself now. Strangle me! No, okay, don't please don't please don't. What magic sorcery is this? The new animation was dark magic. Ink flow. Am I gonna die now? How do I run? I can't run. That frightens me. Why do I feel like Goofy's gotten up? Or Stoopy. I'm gonna name him Stoopy. Stoofy. Stoofy! Goofy, are you alive yet? No? Good. Please don't get up. I hate you, you stupid bag. There's like a bag on the floor. I'm gonna turn around and he's gonna be gone. Huh! <laughs> you dweeb. No, you're not a dweeb. Please don't kill me. I love you. I love cartoons. I love reviewing cartoons, and I'm reviewing a cartoon. Ah! Get the hell out of here. Ah! Ah! No! No! Like this, the creators lied to us. The creator lied to us. What do you mean? I'm Walt Disney. I bring family. I don't know why I'm getting. What the fuck am I talking about now? Oh, an axe. Good. This will definitely come in handy. I like this. I really like this. I'll save my thoughts for probably at the end if I get to the end. But I like this. I like this a lot. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I saw that bull crap. Don't you dare. <laughs> me. I have an axe. I'm Axeman Joe. Axeman Fox. Whatever. Oh, good. Demon magic. The Furbies were here. Am I gonna get? Wait. Was that it? No. Oh, I wanted to play more! No, bull crap! Well! I found the thing that's gonna beat FNAF! Fudge, yeah! This is freaking awesome! I love this! Um, The sounding was good, although when I was listening to that one thing, like it had like surround sound, but like when I moved my head left, 
I heard it from my right ear. When I moved my right, I heard it from the left ear. Let me make sure I mean the other way around. Bendy will return. Oh, this is good. Even if it was only 22 minutes, it, it kept me on edge. It kept me on edge. It's very creepy. It had a good creepy atmosphere. I, it, again, it's, it is... Um. No! Oh, <laughs> it has creepy... It has creepy atmosphere. I like how... You know, like, yeah, even though I was just walking around, I was still a little bit on edge until, like, yeah, I kind of guessed, like, okay, I can't run. So I'm gonna be assuming I won't be chased by anything. But it still had some good scares in it. And the thing is, it wasn't, like, um... Except for maybe, like, the notifications that scared, that were, like, little jump scares for me. Ex except for, like, that, like, there was some good stuff in this. And even, like, um, Spooky's House of Jump Scares, like, whenever, like, one of those little... It was kind of reminded me a little bit of Spooky's House of Jump Scares when, like, the little thing comes up and like, you're like, ah! And it's just, like, a little cardboard, like, ah! Something like that. And it was kind of similar to that, which, oh, and I love Spooky's House of Jump Scares. That was freaking fun. Go check out that, um, that, uh, playthrough. I think I may have deleted the last episode, and that was because of problems, but I'm sorry about that, but I, I got to it. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you believe me. But, um, the game was awesome. It was scary. It had a good jump. It had, like, like, the part where, like, that little creep... One, like, it had the... Uh, I'm like, saying, oh, there's something behind me. But it's part where, like, you kind of don't expect it at some point. Like, that, and we're, like, the little cardboard kind of going, ha! Ah! Just, like, looking at it and pull, pulling back in. And it felt like... It, one, it felt cartoony, maybe just because of the character itself being, like, 2D and just, like, pulling back like that. But, you know, it's like, ah! You pull back, and I'm like, oh, oh, fudge me. That, <laughs> like, that's a good jump scare. And it's not like a ting or a twang or something, you know, loud like, a, you know, a, a modern some modern horror movies. That was just like, pull it, like, oh, fudge me. If you missed it, you missed it. But if you saw it, you're freaking freaking out. Um... It's really good, and again, like it's in the same vein as FNAF or the Furby game. Um, fudge, what is its name? I can't remember, but in the sense that, like, it takes something you know in this case, in FNAF animatronics, in in um Furby's case, Furby, or in this classic cartoons, and makes them ten times scarier. Which even then, like, some classic cartoons are pretty creepy at times, kind of. Um, but. Yeah, this is awesome. I love the art style of it. Kind of reminds me of Bioshock a little bit with like little notifications coming up and like, the, and did he have some little nineteen fifties? I don't know, but like the nineteen fifty ish setting look, um, like Bioshock one, like you know the little guy that teaches you how to use fire your abilities and stuff. Kind of have that look, which is kind of around that era. But yeah, this this was an awesome game. I would definitely say check it out. Um, the first chap, if you want to try it out for yourself, probably put a link in the description below. Uh, the first chapter is on game jolt i'd say support him support him if you can um i'm saving I'm, i gotta save up right now but if i if i am if i'm able to get some money i'll probably i'll probably don't start i'll probably donate a bit but um this game was fun this game was definitely fun i definitely want to see more of this i don't want to check it out go tell markiplier go tell jack i haven't seen them play it yet so i don't know if they have but it's really good and you know those to if those two freaking play a game and and wade and bob it well more wade i think bob i don't i'm not sure but um if them and of course pewdiepie get, play the game they're of course gonna get millions of people to help support it and of course like if one person of just pewdiepie's uh subscription alone could donate a dollar if each person only donated one dollar you pretty much had this all set up um this game probably set up for life but, um, yeah, this was awesome for a small, quick thing, which, again, I figured out pretty quickly. I'm probably not going to get chased by whatever, chased whatever, because, you know, I had no sprint feature. But so it is pretty cool, and I kind of want to see more how this is going to build up. What are they going to do next? They show that you have a weapon, kind of, with the axe. Like, will we get a sprint feature and all that stuff? Probably, because I'm pretty sure you're going to get chased. And also, what is with all this? They summon demons? They, and they use the ink 
to create living tombs, I guess? Since there was a tomb there that they opened up, so... But I don't know. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to check more videos that I've done, please leave the description below and the links beside my head. Low subscription buttons around here somewhere. But either way, thank you so much for watching. Check out my videos, reviews, and so on. And we will. See you later. One, two, bendy ink and machines coming for you. I guess I don't freaking know anymore.